All right, you guys, next workout. Again, I want you guys to challenge yourself, use higher uh, weights in the weight room and to get to that higher rep range so you can really push yourself and benefit. We're gonna start right off with an upper body exercise. Super set we are. So just like the last workout, you're gonna do one exercise and then you're gonna go right into the other one without a break. And then after the two exercises in a row, you're gonna take a break, move on to the next round. So you're gonna take your two dumbbells. What you're gonna do is a chest press. So elbows are gonna be out. Back is nice and flat on the ground. You could have your knees up. You're gonna do a chest press. You're pressing the dumbbells straight up. Elbows are out. You should feel this all along your chest. Remember to grab a heavier weight to push yourself. You're gonna do that and then what you're gonna do is you're gonna turn your wrists so your palms are facing each other. You're gonna do the same press up but your elbows are gonna come in to your side. This is gonna hit the triceps. Again, you're pressing straight up. Dumbbells come right into the side. Elbows are right into the side. Remember to breathe out and take your time. Next up, you're gonna go a little bit heavier with this one. We're gonna do a squat to overhead press. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna rest the dumbbells at your shoulders. You're gonna get into your squat position. As you squat down, you're gonna squat up. Dumbbells come over your head. So it's gonna be an all in one movement. The reason why you can go a little bit heavier is because you're using your lower half to muscle the weights up over your head. Whew. Next, we're gonna be on our back again. We're gonna do tricep extensions. So, same thing as the first exercise. You're gonna be on your back. Hands are gonna be over your head. What you're gonna do is you're gonna bend at the elbow. Dumbbells come next to your head. You're gonna press them straight back up. You should feel a stretch in your triceps. Make sure you're breathing out. You wanna keep your elbows in the same spot. You can go a little bit lighter on this one. It's a little bit harder. And just remember to breathe out and take your time. Next, we're on to a deadlift to upright row. What you're going to do, I'm going to do two sides of this so you can see the deadlift and then the upright row face on. Feet are going to be shoulder width apart. The dumbbells, your palms are going to be facing each other. You're going to do a deadlift. So unlike a squat, you're going to be hinging forward. You're driving your butt back, going down to your ankles. Upright row. Down. <laughs> upright row as you come up. So I just want you to imagine that there is a rope pulling my butt back. You want to squeeze through your glutes. Use your hamstrings to come up. Let me go this way so you can see the upright row. Hinging forward, upright row. I don't want your elbows to go past your shoulders. So you just want your shoulders to be right in line with your elbows. So all one movement. Shoulders are gonna get a little extra burnout right here. You're gonna do a forward raise to a lateral raise. So you're gonna alternate forward, out to the side. Whew. Remember to keep your shoulders down and back so you're not using your traps. Whew. And again, you don't wanna go as far as your shoulders. You wanna stay right in line. Remember to breathe out. Whew. Whew. Then last exercise. We're gonna do lateral raises. So we're gonna be on the side. This is for your glutes. You're gonna bring the band right below your knee this time. You're gonna be nice and relaxed. Your toe is gonna to point the ground. You're gonna bring your foot as high as you can up. And you wanna keep that foot, other foot planted on the ground. 
and then you're just going to roll over, do the opposite side, same thing, you should feel it all right here. And that's it for that workout. Woo! So again, remember to challenge yourself, use heavier weights to get that higher rep range in. Uh, record your uh, weight and the reps you have so in the future you can crush it and go even higher with all the reps and pounds. Have a great day.